I do think that towards the end of his career, and I know one of the cases uh, that I participated in, the last opinion he wrote uh, on the court overturned a precedent that he participated in, a case called Payne versus Tennessee, where uh, uh, in a death penalty case, uh, victim impact testimony was reinstated, and he was very concerned that we were going to value uh, life based upon the value of the victim. He was very concerned about the possible racial consequences of that. And he uh, was at that point venting that the civil rights uh, infrastructure, as Professor Crenshaw discussed, was becoming unraveled. And in fact, he writes an obituary to the unraveling where he cites all the cases that are at risk. Mm -hmm. And so I think he uh, delegated his anger to his pen so that there would be a legacy to continue. Um, but uh, I think that he tried to use uh, humor and precision uh, to unravel the absurdity of those unjust uh, and immoral things that actually have entered into the racial fabric of our conversation in this country and that we yet to have remedied.